board. Let's take in this interesting ring uh, train track here. Pretty cool. This looks like the station. Those, ha those hands are a little bit creepy, the way they're kind of wiggling at me, but that's okay. So let's hit all aboard. In a nice clear room, uh, there's a cool little dog here that chills. I don't know if he does anything other than that. You can play tapes. People were probably born in the 70s or 80s who made this or earlier because they're tapes and not CDs. Oh no, I want music so badly. Don't fall on me, please. Oh, the tape popped out. Okay, we'll do a mix. And then this is the volume. Twist. I think that's maxed. Good enough, anyway. Okay, so the one thing about this game is there was like little to no tutorial that I could find for this. So I had to mess around quite a while, for quite a while to make sure I, I knew what I was doing a little bit in order to make a video for it. So you press the menu button to bring up your little the toolbox, which is pretty cool. And you pick just uh, stuff. You can either, I, I really like how there's some presets up here because I suck at building and I don't want to take like an hour to build an awesome like train model. Um, it'll just take you long. So you could pick these presets, but um, if you were to build your own, you can start with one of these four tables. I'll start one very just briefly here. So I'll pick the flat table like that. Uh, then you need to get this out of your way. You can go like that and close it and then hide toolbox. And it goes away and you can kind of reposition the tip. So I, I do not know how to reposition something after it's already placed. Because as you can see, it's not level. But I know how to uh, change like the world space or to move the world space. I can't, I don't know how to move the physical object that I can figure out. But uh, well, that's good enough, I guess. So let's bring up the toolbox again. Uh, let's look at the tracks. So we'll make just a very simple Start right there. We'll do a little turn and it snaps kind of into place, which is very nice for you. Like that. Uh, wait, which one did I do? The long one? I have to make sure it is symmetrical. This is the most creative train track of all time. So there we got the track. Now we can do some scenery stuff. I don't know, oh, is this a building? Little building in the middle there. Uh, little, oh, actually, I like that. Actually, we'll do both of them. This one looks like a Starbucks. Gotta have a Starbucks by the train. The green, you know. Oh, and then it can have little rooftops. Like that, cool. So then, after we got that done, we can bust out the trains. Should I put like this bullet train on this tiny little track? That would be great. So let's start with, oh, this uh, kind of long one like that oh oh it's because it's downhill so it's not moving yet this gets kind of pretty cool actually so let's put a uh a uh is this oh crap is this a front only or is this a kaboot uh, the, the thing attachment i don't think so let's get rid of that uh, oh it's one of these is what you need right is this the only like attachments you can place on the thing okay this is something i don't know how to do oh no <laughs> what the heck Oh, it blew up. How did that happen? Oh, it's on fire. No, this is going, it was going so well, this video before that. So maybe I'll do the most like generic one just in case something goes wrong. Here we go. So now, um, so it doesn't move right now and I actually don't know how to make it move. This is my first time trying this. So I know how to make it move in a, um, a preset, but to do my own, do I have to go in so now I'm in my train, on my track, there's the building. Let's go see the Starbucks, shall we? Uh, I don't know how to, oh, no, no, that's reverse. That's reverse. So you can derail if you go too fast. It's far too slow. And now we're chugging away. Do I have a, yes. I'm like a kid at Christmas. This is great. Is this a break? Yeah, that's the break. And there's the Starbucks. Should we stop and get some coffee? Let's go a bit quicker. Ooh, and look how big the radio is over there. Oh, do I have two? Oh, that's the choo-choo, this is the bell. That means you're taking off, right? And this means like, oh, what the, there's a fire over there. Is that the, oh, is that the one I threw? The, the wagon that I threw? Oh, why are we going so fast? 
So, okay, so that's cool. So then to bounce, you just bounce, I think, right? Oh, you press the menu button, that's right. So there, so that's that, that's cool, right? How you can just, so then there's other things like tunnels you can put down like that. You can go check out what my tunnel looks like. <laughs> it's gonna go off the, off the rails though. No, no, stop, I wanna go in it. There we go. Oh, oh, I'm in it. Oh, we're gonna go off the track, woo! Oh, oh, sweet, we can, we can keep going. Oh, we're gonna fall off the table. We're gonna fall off the table, no! I love you, world! Oh, does it fall off the table? Oh, oh! <laughs> oh, I'm on fire. Okay, there are so many things on fire now. Okay, so that's tunnels. There's props. Oh, here's a Christmas, oh no. I don't want, oh wow, it's huge. Do I know how to replace that? Oh, you can replace the tree. Anyway, so that's that. Miscellaneous is like desks and wow, is that a cannon? Like that, there's a colorful, uh, is that a llama? And uh, that's pretty much, yeah, that's, that's all the options. I pretty much went over them. You could dim the lights to make it a little bit more intimate. Like that. Now it's a little dark. The dog is there chilling. Let's turn it back up. Um, so now you can clear the room. Delete everything like that. And now we can take a quick look at some of the very creative pre-mades. And you could take a take a picture, which is kind of cool. You hold it down and then I think you press the trackpad and it'll go over there to those pictures you watch. Boom, right there, that one. I just took a picture of the dog. And what's weird is it loads it like a game, I think. Well, I don't know. These ones you can load. So let's look at um, this wheel. Boom. Look at that. Oh, this is like the menu screen, right? So, you know, you can get some ideas from these pre-made ones, it looks like. Uh, let's go on the train then. Please. Okay, let me get closer to it. Doosh. <laughs> okay. Now we're going. Oh, there's the light. Wow, that light fixture is huge. So we are technically then upside down. There's the table down there. Oh, what, this, what does this do? Oh, decouple, front to back. Oh, that's here. There are the buildings, a barn. Woo! Okay, so that's that one. Wait, switch directions. No. That is not working. We are going approximately 20 kilometers per hour. All right, so let's exit it. Now we can clear the room again. Let's look at one more real quick. This one's pretty cool, the winter one. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. And now let's just observe, man. This beautiful, oh, there's a yellow train down there that I can hop on. But as you can see, wow, does it go through all of the, oh my gosh, look, it's got like multiple levels, like a bridge part. Oh, and is it going up? Yeah, it's going up right there. Oh, we can ride it as it goes up higher and higher. Let's ride it. Oh, I won't do both. Oh, it's just really quiet. The choo-choo, at least for me, it's quiet. Eject! What? Is that like if something just goes horribly wrong? And I don't think I could go... No, I can't go in the back. It would be nice to maybe be back there and like be able to see everything. Uh, like a convertible, a train convertible. But wow, yeah, so we're going higher and higher. Stop. That's the brake, of course. So let's, um, what's the speed? Is this the max speed? I don't see a, is this? Oh, that's speed. That's the speed. So let's take a look here. Oh, okay, we're stopped. A little bit quicker there. Let's see if I can speed up on the straightaway and then maybe slow down. Oh, it's shaking so much. Okay, slow down, slow down. Ooh, we're going high. Higher, higher. Oh man, we're wobbling so much. Ooh. Okay, let's go fast on the straightaway. And slow down on the turn. See, I learned this from Derail Valley. I don't know if you guys saw that game I did, uh, the demo of it. Um, it's, it's a train game. 
Oh, now we're gonna go in the top part. The middle, the, 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 the top of the mountain here. We made it to the top. Hey, oh. All right, oh, crossroads. Oh, bump. Can't see. Oh, here we go. Very cool, what can I say? We go, oh, we're going higher. This is like the highest point. We're on a high part of the top mountain. And let's go off the rails, woo! Ow! Boom, is it gonna blow? Here, let's see what that looks like from up here. Where is it? Oh, right there, <laughs> oh, good thing I'm not in that. Wow, oh, it's floating in the water. Should we go in it? Can I go in it again? <laughs> That's great. So, yeah. All right, well, that is Locomancer for you. Fun little train game. Uh, pretty cool. I love how you, you could just go and, like, down on the train and actually, like, ride your creation. Pretty cool. So thank you so much, as always, for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you're new to my channel and are interested in VR or gaming in general, be sure to subscribe to my channel for all of my latest updates in the future. Thank you once again. Till next time, peace.